I've had cause to have a discussion with one of Nigeria's luckiest uh, uh, people. And he was talking about how he became something at a very young age. Yeah. And I asked him pointedly that, who have you groomed to do the same thing? I can proudly say that I've groomed somebody um, to replace me on the board in Nigerite. I mean, he looked up to me and uh, I did fight for him to become the marketing director. And uh, right now he's doing better than me, and I'm mm -hmm. very happy about that. He's doing very much better than me. I'm very happy. So the idea of selfishness is a major problem in this country. We are too self-centered. We don't want to develop people. We want to build empires around ourselves. I can proudly say that throughout my stay in Nigeria, I did not employ anybody that was related to me at all. I made it a policy that if you come in, you must come in on merit. Mm. I never, and of course, I hurt a lot of my family members in the process, but I stood by it. And uh, today, I, I look back and I think I did my bit, and uh, I have since moved on. I don't even think about that area again about, <laughs> at all in my life. You know, I have better things to think about now. Mm. You know, life is a continuum. You've yes. got to do one, leave them, give it to others on. to manage. And then go on. So many things to cover. I still have a lot to do. I tell you, Leonardo da Vinci, one of the greatest artists that ever lived, was an engineer. I went to his uh, place of abode in the Clorisse, the Chateau de Clorisse in, uh, in the Louvre, Lower Valley region in, yeah. in France. Yeah. I visited uh, the place and I saw the miniature, the maquet of the machines he developed. Machines? It, yes, Not he paintings. developed a lot of machines. A lot. Leonardo da Vinci was also designed aeroplanes. He foresaw aeroplanes. And Leonardo da Vinci lived 500 years ago. Uh, I also talked about Michelangelo. Michelangelo was also an architect. But Leonardo was the most gifted. He was an engineer, he was an architect. He also drew um, human, human oh. veins. He used to take cups, human cups, dissect it and draw. Look, I visited the Queen's private collection uh, in the 80s and I was shocked about how Leonardo da Vinci was able to uh, draw veins and arteries. Human veins. In human, human veins and arteries. And it's typical, very, very representative of the current, and, uh, current state of anatomy. Uh, as far back as the 500 years. So, there have been people who have done things I've do I'm doing. Uh, look, there's nobody that is special. We all do our bit and contribute to society and add value you know to society the whole essence of living is not how to how many houses you build how many wives you marry and uh, how many children you have no the essence of living is giving and creating values to your society and that's the essence of living to me and um, people have done that and they are doing it